Today, we're gonna go over how to draw cute Halloween objects. Hey, how's it going? I'm Enrique, uh, artist and illustrator. If you're a complete beginner and you don't know how to draw at all, this is perfect for you. If you love Halloween the way I do, uh, definitely watch this lesson. It's relatively short, easy, and it will kind of change your life in a way because you'll be able to do a lot of this stuff now. But let's get started. To go over here and draw a curve line over here for the side of the cat's head first. Put that a little bit thicker with a marker there. There you go. Gonna go over here for a triangle for the top of the one ear. Line across. Triangle for the other ear. Curve around. Lie over here, curve for the paw. Here, curve for the paw. I'm gonna throw a little line here for obviously the, the you know the fingers of the paw, right here as well. Then I'm gonna close it up. All right. This side would do the same thing. I'm gonna draw a finger of the paw, finger of the paw here, close that up. Line across here. Line across here. That would be the uh, top of the pumpkin there. Hey, it's coming out of the pumpkin head. So let's go over here and draw the one of the eyes. It's gonna be low on the head. So that's gonna be a theme of this whole thing to make it cute. We're gonna make the eyes far apart and low on the head. Generally low on the head, not super low. All right, there. Let's draw an upside down, a tiny upside down triangle, and I want to make it, you know, kind of uh, in the middle between those shapes. Right here, I'm going to draw a curve over here for the mouth, curve for the other side of the mouth. Let's draw a triangle inside the ear. Triangle over here for the inside of this ear. I'm actually going to draw, I'm going to fill this area in because it's going to be the inside of the pumpkin. We'll talk about that in a second. So let's draw the pumpkin that the cat's coming out of, okay? I'm going to go over here, curve for one side of the pumpkin. Over here is the far side. Curve over here for this far side. At the bottom, I'm gonna go like this. It's gonna have a little bit of some dips at the bottom because gonna, the pumpkin's gonna have striation, right, on the at the surface of it. So that's gonna kind of connect on the bottom here. I'm gonna go over here, line, line, over here, line, line, curve over here, curve over here. Line over here, line over here, so you can see the inside of the pumpkin, right? The pumpkin has like a depth to it, right? Because you're cutting into it. So what you want to do is you want to fill this part in, fill this part in, and then that part acts as the surface part of the pumpkin. Put another triangle in the center for the nose. Line across here, fill in. I'm going to draw a curved line underneath. And I'm going to draw a line across here, and then I'm going to give it one tooth, right? One square tooth, and I'm going to connect it like that. Right on. I'm going to draw a little bit of a curve shape here because we're talking about the depth of that pumpkin still. And then I'm going to fill this part in. All right. So now we're going to draw a line here, All right here, see that line? That's going to be a striation, but it's thin. It's a thinner line. And over here, I'm going to draw another thinner line. And right here as well, but I'm not going to draw them right through the features. I'm just going to kind of like so. So you're going to, it's almost like connect the dots because you're avoiding the features there. All right, that's it for that. Let's go into the color really quick. I'm going to use uh, just a regular colored pencil. 
Um, I like Prisma color, so I would I would prefer use that. But these are flat colors, really. I'm just kind of pushing down here, flatly, so you don't really have to, um, you know, like work that hard at it. You don't even really have to, um, like, color it if you don't like. You know, it has like a cute kind of look as it is. And uh, just do it to give it some some flair, right? But it also just like Halloween colors really bring to life a Halloween drawing like nothing else, right? Because the colors are as big a part as Halloween as anything, right? The orange, like the green, the yellow, that kind of stuff really brings to to life. Um, just kind of the season and the memories and the um, just kind of the excitement of the season. Uh, there's something incredibly fun about Halloween, and I don't know what it is, but for me personally, when I think of Halloween, I think of um, you know all these you know cool memories I had uh, trick or treating and all the movies that I've seen, um, and that's personally what I get from it because I'm older. I, I don't know if. You know, if you're younger, what do you get from Halloween exactly, right? Like, I'm curious, is it just the fun, right? Um, is it the movies? I guess it's just the same stuff, pretty much, right? All right, I colored that in. And if you really want, you can leave the cat white, or what you could do is, I'm gonna grab like a pink, color in the uh, ear. Wait, that doesn't work, hold on. There we go. The ear here, pink, and the inside of the ear. Um, and it should be a black cat. Um, let's fill it in black, but very lightly, like I said. I'm going to just shade it in lightly. I don't really want to press hard on it because I want to be able to see the features of the face. And the only way to do that is to lightly color it in. You know, I want it to appear as a black cat. But if I really dig into this, you're not going to be able to see the eyes or the mouth there at all, right? So I'm going to keep it relatively uh, light. So it's almost going to be like a gray cat in a way because I want those features to pop out. All right. Oops. I mean, I forgot one thing here. Um, inside the nose here, I didn't... Um, there you go. I should color those in. I'm making that color one shape. Anyways, that's it. Um, that's a really good one. I love really doing this one at uh, different events. You know, like just kind of like, oh, you know, draw something on the board or draw something. You know, I was like, I like drawing this one. I think this is really cute. People really love it. So thank you so much. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, Feel free to like and subscribe to stay up to date on all of our latest videos.